was that? I just saw a big ass butterfly. What the fuck? Oh, is that like a waypoint for um the story? What the fuck? That's literally the first time I've ever seen that. Oh man, whose house is this? Is this my boys? Rebellion. I think his name was what? Hagrid? Hagrid? Oh my god. Now that looks nice. This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. What do you mean? There's nothing around this. All right, let's see what this person wants from us. Ah, it is good to see you, my friend. Hello, Natty. How are you? I am well, thank you. I was there, and I saw what happened with Rookwood and Harlow at the Three Broomsticks. I have been worried about you. I'm all right at the moment. If you don't mind my asking, why were they looking for you? They want something that Professor Fig and I found at Gringotts. When were you at Gringotts? Just before we came to Hogwarts. In fact, it's why I was late to the sorting ceremony. A portkey brought us there after the dragon attacked our carriage. What on earth? There's one more thing. It's a bit odd, if I'm honest. Professor Fig says I have a rare connection to a powerful form of ancient magic. I... What does that mean? I'm still learning, but I can see traces of it. And I've cast magic Yet and can otherwise explain. I know that's a lot to absorb. It is. Something so small, and she releases her questions. whole life story. For now, oh it my is safe God. to say that Rookwood and Harlow are a threat to both of us. To all of us. Which is why I wanted to speak to you. Everyone has been talking about you defending Hogsmeade from that troll attack. And I shall never forget watching Serona stand up to Rookwood and Harlow in the Three Broomsticks. Both of you have inspired me to take a stand of my own. What sort of stand? Men like Rookwood and Harlow are the reason my mother and I left Matibili land. I am not going to sit by and watch them destroy my new home. Good. Rookwood and Harlow are a dangerous pair. And you should know that Rookwood is in league with Ranrock. I had heard they were seen in Hogsmeade together. All the more reason they must be stopped. Rumor has it that Theophilus Harlow runs Rookwood's day-to-day -day operations. Taking him down would cripple Rookwood's entire enterprise. That may be true, but shouldn't Officer Singer handle someone like Harlow? I spoke with her. She was polite, but perhaps understandably would not discuss details with a student. I overheard some of Rookwood's lot talking about a massive poaching operation that Harlow is planning. I was thinking that we could investigate a bit, try to get the evidence that Officer Singer needs. All right, but how? I am going to watch and listen, find out precisely what Harlow is up to. I shall reach out when I know more. In the meantime, remember, I am here if you need me. Okay. Thank you, Natty. Natty. Be on your guard. You can't imagine how inconvenient Natty. that hour was before I invented I you. I your pardon. How dare you threaten me? What's going on here? Wonder what who happened? lives here? I never thought Ramrock's loyalists would go this far. Oh my god, so much is happening all at once, dude. Uh, Get your bitch ass up. Oh, look at all this loot. All this loot just waiting for me. Hell yeah. Not your mommy. What the fuck? Weird. Why don't you do some more drawings for me? Mm -hmm. Hello, sir. What do you sell here? Hello. 
I'm Jalal Semi, and this is my potion shop. I can answer any questions you have about the town. Oh, another one. What do you have for sale? What can I help you with today? Oh, you don't you don't have shit. I hope to see you again sometime. This dude, that person didn't have shit. What the fuck? Okay, I still can't equip the Oh another wand handle. Okay, we'll keep that one. Just because we're, you know, slithering and all that. Let's do that. Let's do that, but change the appearance to what we've been rocking with. Uh, no. Okay. Let's go see what's happening over here. There's a side mission, but again, the side mission, I'll just do that my own time. I never thought Ramrock's loyalists would go this far. Ooh. The woman needs help uh, just across the water beyond the dock. They must have come this way. Think. <gasps> Enemies. I've no idea who it is you think I might have seen. I've been busy with my research. I do not have time to. Victor Rookwood, don't give a dock. She's nip back your time. Oi, speak of the devil. Mr. Rookwood would like a word with you. A student. You can't be sick. <laughs> oh. Leave her alone. Stupid I'll say less. Oh, I bitch. Whoa. Come, bitch. Fuck you think this is. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Oh, what's the light go out of your eyes? Yikes, dude. Uh, the collection section of you feel good. Okay. Oh, hang on. We oh. 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 Dumb bitch. What's up with the camera, man? What happened? Like literally yesterday, it was so good. Now it's like, what the fuck? Jesus. Are you all right? I am. Thanks in no small part to your excellent defensive skills. Care to tell me why two Ashwinders were ready to dispatch me to get to you? Ashwinders? Victor Rookwood's thieves and extortionists, his little cronies. They seemed quite keen on you. It's a long story, but thank you for your help. Hmm. Well, you've avoided them for the moment. Priya warned me things were getting dangerous. Best get moving on my research before they return. You're a researcher. Nora Treadwell at your service. Historian and archaeologist specializing in Merlin's work and life. Oh. Merlin? Of the legend of King Arthur? The very same. Merlin attended Hogwarts, you know. And I'm studying some curious fixtures he left here centuries ago. Fixtures? These vine-covered pillars, dozens of them, all around the area. I've taken to calling them the Trials of Merlin. I believe he created them as a diversion for his fellow Slytherins. <laughs> he was terribly fond of puzzles and enigmas. I can see why you're so interested in Merlin. I'd be keen to know more about the Trials. Well then, I'll let you in on a little secret. No one has yet managed to figure out how they work. Mm -hmm. But I believe I have just unlocked a crucial clue. Fire. I suspect that Mallow Sweet is an important component in getting the trials to work. Mallow Sweet? Versatile herb. 
Merlin repeatedly mentioned it in his writings. I had just arrived to test my theory when I was so rudely interrupted. <laughs> you see, each swirl in Merlin's writing has a symbol in the center. That started me thinking, what if the Mallow Suite is meant to be placed at the center of the symbols? Precisely. Would you care to do the honors? We can see what comes of our little hypothesis. I brought a trunk chock full of Mallow Suite with me. It's just over there Rebellion. by my tent. Okay. This trunk? Yes, take plenty, even if you already have some. I have the Mallow Suite. Lovely. Now, notice the vines on these pillars here, as well as a stone swell on the ground. Each trial has these features. Place the Mallow Suite on the swell. And we'll see what happens. Wait, what? My oh, word. did you see that? The vines disappeared and suddenly what should I do? Bears. This is on the territory. I am curious about these. Oh, I knew it. I knew it. I was waiting for the fire for uh since yesterday. What a day. I can hardly believe it. Okay. I take it we can call that a success. We can indeed. However, I now have even more questions. How does it work? I must review my notes. I may have missed something. Are all of the trials like this one? Hmm? Oh, not precisely. Well, I think each has those telltale vines and the swirl on the ground. You should feel free to solve them as you come across them. I believe I have what I need to continue my research. My guess is that each will also require Mallow Suite, which you can find in Hogsmeade should you need more. Oh. I really must be off. Such a pleasure to meet you. Okay, something I could do off stream. Hell and yeah. Do be careful out here. Now I've got what I needed. I shall return to the safety of my notes and books. Trials of Merlin. Okay, but the real question is. What's the next uh, mission? It's like mission. A place right out of a storybook. Revelio. Scrope knows about the old book you found for Professor Fink. Scrope can help you, and you can help Scrope get to the courtyard past the pendulum. If you don't know it, you'll see it easy enough. And don't tell anyone what you're up to, especially Professor Blank. Okay. Hello, Mr. Semi. What can I do for you? What do you have for sale? Uh, let's see. What can I help you with today? So, I don't need that. Delicate wings used in the focus potion. They commonly found in open fields. Uh, spell damage for limited amount. I mean, I could just upgrade that. Uh, we can sell that. I'll have no trouble selling this. Thank you. Where's Nico? <laughs> I hope to see you again sometime. You know how he is. He made up an excuse. I guess an excuse to not play. He said he was sick, so you know. Said he he was down to play for like a minute, for like a like less than an hour or so. But yeah, you know. I'd rather just continue the story on my own. <laughs> and the thing about it is like, I was literally waiting. I didn't want to progress too quickly uh, before. Uh, I didn't want to progress too quickly so he could, so we could play together, but you know, it is what it is. All right, let's see. Scrub knows about the book you found. Is it missing something? Scrub does not believe. 
It is safe to speak out in the open. Scrub has left another note across the bridge among the circle of rocks. Take care to tell no one about this. Scrub. Okay. Who is Scrub? Hmm, that might be the the little jits that have been disappearing on us. Oh, so okay. So that's what that thing is. Oh. What the fuck? How do we get in there? Burn it? Um. What the fuck? <coughs> Come on. That should be fine. Is it good? The game? Yeah, I like it. I really like it. Almost there. Head for the pumpkins just down the stone circle. Look inside one of them. You may be able to help poor broken. Okay. Pumpkins. Ooh, I think I know just the place. Revenia. What the fuck is that? I see it, I see it. Uh, the young slithering must be exceptionally curious by now. Meet scrub at the water edge by the broken docks. Down to the water's edge. Hmm. This had better not be a trick. <gasps> oh! Oh. Okay, so there's no fall damage, thank god. Thank you for coming all this way. The name's Scrope. Scrope serves the headmaster. I've been in the Black family for years. Oh, I can't trust this Apologies dude. Apologies for the abundance of notes. Scrope wanted to be sure you weren't followed. What's this all about? Your notes mentioned the book I found in the restricted section. Scrope can tell you more in exchange for your help, but no one, especially the headmaster, can know. I mean, the, these fuckers in the movies, they're extremely loyal to their, um, <laughs> I guess they're masters. So I, 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 can, I can't trust this fucker. Of course, what can I do for you? I'd rather not risk uh, trouble with Black. Happy to undermine authority if it benefits me. Happy to help, especially if you can shed light on the book. Scrope is grateful. Scrope's late mistress, Apollonia Black, may she rest in peace, was a student at Hogwarts uh, over 50 years ago. Before she died, she spoke with passion of pages ripped from a book. Scrope suspects she took them to her private grotto. She was delirious at the end, poor thing. Mistook Belladonna for elderberries. <laughs> Scrope tried to warn her. Oh, so I'm she was the one. That. Let's take the pages. But how do you benefit if I find the pages? Scrope believes that a treasured Black family ring is also in the grotto. Scrope wishes to give it to the headmaster. Apollonia forbade Scrope from entering the grotto long ago. Scrope continues to honor her wishes. Scrope would not dare ask a student for help. But when Scrope learned you were looking for those pages, Scrope thought you might also find the ring. How do you know about the book I found? Tell me about the ring. What happened to your ear? How did you injure your ear? The Blacks have a tradition of decapitating their house elves when their service is no longer required. One day, dear Apollonia was understandably frustrated with Scrope and got a bit too eager with a cleaver. Scrope was able to convince the sweet girl of his value and now views this small injury as a reminder of her good heart. How did you know that I'd found a book and that it's missing pages? Scrope and the other house elves are good at staying out of sight. Scrope hears and sees many things in the castle. Scrope knows how to keep secrets. 
I mean, that's true. Every time I see them, they immediately disappear. It seems this may help us both. I shall do it. Scrope is relieved. Scrope hoped the young Slytherin would be willing to help. Take this toast to the grotto just down the coast. And place it on the pedestal there. Good luck. Scrope will wait right here for you. Best of luck finding your pages. And the Rebellion. Oh. Huh. Oh. Okay, where are we going? Ah, fuck it. I think we can walk there. Not that far. <gasps> what is that? What the fuck? Whoa! Some bitch. Skadoosh. What the fuck? Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm better get clapped. Jesus, I can't do shit. Oh my god. Why are these fuckers so hard? Jesus. Oh my god. I was fighting frogs the hardest <laughs> the hardest enemy. What the fuck? Yo, where are we going? Yeah, my probably should have fast traveled. Oh fuck it. of toast I suppose that's where it goes what the fuck <gasps> oh 
secret room. Revenia. Oh. <laughs> Could it be a what visitor? The <laughs> ah. The name's Richard Jackdaw. I was a student, just like you, about a century ago. How in the world did you find this place? A house elf named Scrope sent me. Said I might find the Oh, this is a story. Oh. Ah. Sorry to say I sold the ring a long time ago. Poor Scrope. Still holds a candle for Apollonia, I reckon. Can't say I blame him. I stole all these treasures just to impress her. Alas, it was to no avail. I thought a secret map I pilfered from Peeves would pique her interest. But she simply rolled her eyes. Damn. What would I want with yellowed old pages torn from a book? Not my finest moment. I'd like to have those pages if you don't mind. They're not here. I thought if Apollonia wasn't interested in the map on the pages, perhaps it would lead to something that would intrigue her. So... I followed the map to what I can only describe as an enchanted cave of some kind. And you see what happens next. <laughs> Here's an idea. Why don't you meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest and I'll show you Ooh, where to find finally the finally some fighting. I suppose if that's the only way for me to get those pages, I'll meet you at the forest. I'm sure the pages are still tucked in my waistcoat. If you don't mind the sight of a, well... My decapitated skeleton. They're yours for the taking. Oh, say less. Um, oh, here we go. Hmm, a map. It doesn't appear to be connected to the missing pages. Best hang on to it for now. That must be the bridge. It says it's I think you said like candles or lighter candles and the bridge we gotta use this fire spell to uh, to solve the puzzle I guess okay let's see <clears throat> time for the forbidden forest I've been exploring that area not a lot, but I just been fucking up some some fuckers over there. Let's see what what the, what does uh he got to say? Hello, Scrope. Thanks to you, I was able to enter Apollina's grotto. The toast was the key. I met a ghost there, Richard Jackdaw, who's agreed to lead me to the pages I've been looking for. Oh, that boy was never good enough for Apollonia. Oh, what of the Black Family Ring? I'm sorry to say that Jackdaw sold it long ago. Sad news indeed. Scrope shall need to think of another way to impress the headmaster. Well, Scrope takes some consolation in knowing that the young Slytherin found what they needed. I did. Thank you again, Scrope. You're a credit to house elves. <laughs> oh, man. Enough your boing. Let's get the story. Let's get. Ooh, what's that? Ah, oh, okay. I think I see it. There we go. And then maybe fire. There we go. I should investigate. Now, what do we got in here? Revenia. Um. Was that it? Just the chest? Ain't no way. Incendio. Revelia. Ain't no way. It was just the chest. Oh my god. Okay, let's go. Uh, let's go over here. Are you right? Where, where? 
Where the fuck am I going? Ah, there we go. Okay, okay, okay. What are you up to now? Revelio. I need to learn the disarming charm before... What the fuck is that? Uh, before I can follow Richard Jackdon, ghost into the Forbidden Forest. The Ministry should round up all the so-called Revelio good boys and demand to know where they got their magic. Wait, but where? What? Where am I supposed to find the dis this this blah, blah, that thing? Uh oh! Oh my God! <laughs> Well, I wish I saw this earlier. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. There we and go. Nice, you can advance by accessing map all the time. Um. Time from day to night or night to day. Oh. you to do i think so <laughs> professor i completed all of your most recent assignments well done then you're ready to learn expelliarmus pay close attention the disarming charm may often be all you need to defeat the most powerful dark witches and wizards you might encounter spell casting requires a focused mind and a steady wand Easy. Dude, holy shit, we have so many spells. <laughs> Good work. The dummy is here if you wish to stay in practice. Um, okay. Maybe fire is necessary. The pulling thing, honestly. You know? Uh, let's see. Yeah, we could, yeah, we could just remove the pulling thing. If we need it, then, you know, we'll... You seem to have the right end of the stick, but keep practicing. Expelliarmus may save your life one day. Leviosa. Expelliarmus! Oh, Jesus. Okay, I think we, I think we got that. Let's see what else what else do we gotta do so now we can go there ghost of our love venom is the dead okay yeah all that it looks like um i could just do that my my own time now we could okay that you know at least it was a quick as hell to do all that Nice to see you, my young friend. Fuck, I need more health potions. Eh, fuck it. We'll just go in like that. Revenio.
There we go. Here I am, as good as my word. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised to see you. It took the cunning of a Slytherin to track down these pages. Well said. Now where do we go from here? Follow me. I shall lead you as far as I can, but I fear I may remain a tad reluctant to revisit the scene of my demise. Keep your eyes open for a birdbath. When you find it, say Inframuros. I think it's Latin. Or Greek. As you can imagine, I never paid much attention in school. Shall we? Um... Aside from the birdbath, anything else I should look for? Indeed. A few landmarks. A stone bridge, a waterfall, and, if I recall, a lake. You'll see. You've been very oh, helpful. Man. Thank you. Surprising how much of this is rather unfortunately coming back to me. All the spiders. Yeah, I think I already killed these fuckers. Hmm. Yes. You know, the closer we get, the more I'm remember. <laughs> Probably best I leave you to it. Simply stick to the path and keep a sharp eye on the bird bar. Rebellion. Protego. Stupid Come on, dude. Nothing to do now. Jesus. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Dumb bitch. What? Shaboing! Uh oh. Jesus Christ, dude. Now, who the fuck is this dude? Uh, where'd you go? <laughs> what the fuck? Damn, hopefully I didn't kill him. Okay, now she burned that? There it is. I like to see it. Okay. Ah, the waterfall. For a thief, Jackdaw's surprisingly as good as his word. What was that? Okay, nothing looks crazy. Everything's normal. Something oddly solemn about this place. Such regal creatures, stags. Revenia. There it is, just as Jackdaw described. Intramuros. Home. Renrock knew you'd eventually lead us to whatever it is you're hiding. Attack! Whoa! Oh my god. I've always said this. So Bitch. Thank <laughs> you. 
No risk those loyalists will report back to Ranrock now. Let's see where Jackdaw has led me. Jesus Christ, dude. Jackdaw's tomb. I wonder how big this place is. Um, okay. Rebellion. Nothing like seeing dead spiders. Casual visitors down here. I wonder if any of my spells will help me through this. Uh oh. Oh my god, such a fucking bitch. down here what the fuck I wonder if I can move that platform somehow I can't. Oh, Revelia. Ain't no way. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. There we go. Revelio. <laughs> Just for that, okay. Well, Jack will solve this, so can I. 
Let's go. What, another puzzle? Perhaps the next symbol is hidden somewhere. Oh, Rebellion. great. Um. Oh yeah. We're getting there. Revenia. Oh. <laughs> what? How's it not hitting him? Maybe. Okay, it doesn't work. <laughs> Jesus. wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. I think I'm going the right way, hopefully. Whew, it's a good thing Jackdaw didn't fall down here. Holy fuck it, the delay, the delay now is, is, it's kind of crazy. Okay, so I'm not, okay. It must be over here then. Dude, <laughs> what the fuck? We could go there later. Not a headless skeleton in sight, but I may as well help myself to this. I guess I'll go there now. Okay, um, let's see what we got over here. My God, uh, what this? <laughs> Incendio. This is about to be annoying. That's odd. I'd have thought Jack would have been interested. There's no sign of him. Revelia. Okay, nothing crazy so far. Whoa! 
<laughs> what the fuck is happening? What? What? Oh my god, this shit is annoying. like to see man i'm glad richard jackdaw left a little something behind for me but where could he be Incendium. come on now Ain't no way I can't go through there. Oh my god. Yeah, now I can see why he died here, because holy fuck, this place is huge. Okay, this must be the way to get um, over there. Hopefully. No, 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 no it's not there. Over here. I knew that. Oh, I collected rewards. Ooh. Hell yeah, dude. An untouched chest. Chapter wasn't very thorough in uh -oh. search of this cave. This looks like a boss fight. Not a headless skeleton in sight. But I may as well help myself to this. Watch, there's gonna be a huge one right now. Anything over here? Oh, there it is. The bridge. It's almost complete. God, dude, the delay. Stupid. Jesus Christ, dude. I knew it. The bosses. Oh my God. Big Chungus. <laughs> Ain't no way, got Dumb bitch. Dumb bitch. Kind of hard. Uh, collect it. Rebellion. Yeah. 
Ravenia. Okay, so there's one there, second one there. Where's the third one? I'm glad Richard Jack left and left something behind for me, but where could he be? One, two, oh, there it is. Okay, so do that, do that, I need to look around for the symbol. and that. There we go. Jesus, dude, this guy died at literally <laughs> so far into this cave. I must be getting closer to Jackdaw's remains. Uh oh. And those pages. Revenia. Well, here we go. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. Thank you for keeping these pages safe all these years. Here it is. The map that brought your doom, Jackdaw. Hmm. Is there something beyond this room? All the enemies, I knew it. This. Oh my god. Okay, now... The big chungus now. Not only one, but two more. Dumb bitch. Ain't no way they didn't get him. Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. Ooh! They need to. Bitch. <laughs> yeah. Magic protects me until I'm able to make my way out of here. Um, what? Uh, am I supposed to go through it? Oh, okay. What is this place? Revenia. Uh oh, what's going on? What is all this? Teleporter? <gasps> oh, these fuckers. Can it be? It's you. Has someone finally found our map chamber? I recognize you from the pensives. You're Professor Rackham. I am indeed. 
I must confess that I am surprised to see someone so young standing before me. I'm the same age that you and Isadora Morganark were when you started at Hogwarts. You've paid attention, and might I presume you share our ability? To see traces of ancient magic? Yes, sir, I do. As you have likely realized by now, our ability gives us a unique relationship with all forms of magic. We can access expressions of magic that few others can. Opportunities will arise that allow you to sharpen this rare talent. Do not okay. squander them. I won't, Professor. Thank you. We have much to discuss. But first, a map found in a certain book led you here. Place the book on the pedestal. I don't have the book with me, sir. Hmm. That is unfortunate. I'm afraid we must pause our conversation until you return with the book. Why is it called the Map of Chambers? Are you... Are you a seer? Very well. I'll retrieve the book right away. Good. We shall speak again once the book is in place. Oh my god, all this work just to that? Your connection to ancient magic has unlocked talents? <gasps> Oh, bro, I'm already level what? 14, 13, 15? Uh, you've earned talents for at level 5. You may spend these. Oh. Room of requirement. These talents enhance your use of potions and combat plants. Maybe style these talents improve your ability to sneak around. I uh, don't really need that right now. These talents improve your overall effectiveness. Yeah, that might be it. This one looks dope as hell. These talents increase your abilities with the dark arts spells. These talents help improve your spell casting. So we're for sure gonna go this one. What the fuck? Okay, okay. I'm I'm uh, I'm gonna look I'm gonna look through these and then we'll we'll continue. Okay, yep, we're back. <laughs> uh, so pretty much everything went to core, dark arts, and spell. Finally, I was waiting to use all that shit. Exit the map chamber. Rebellion. Dude, that can't just be it, right? There's got to be more in here. Little secrets, maybe? No? Okay. What is that? I knew it. Oh, this is where I came from. Never mind. That's where I came from. Okay, we're getting shit done, dude. Hell yeah. I found the pages and the map chamber. Why would I need the book? I mean, you know, it has everything in there, so... Wait. Oh, I thought we were at Hogwarts. Okay, since we're here, might as well use that. <laughs> Seeing him almost cry gets me, dude. <laughs> okay. Um... What else do we need? Got that. Maybe this. I'm back at Hogwarts. I wonder when Professor Fig will be back. I did promise him I wouldn't neglect my studies. Hmm. Suppose I have enough to distract myself with till he returns with the book. Rebellion. Oh, holy shit, there's a lot of stuff here. Um. Oh, these things. Okay. You need to learn to pulso, the banishing charm. Rebellion. Objects or adversaries away. Complete the required tasks and meet me in my classroom. What do you say? 
Oh, here it is. So these things, um, I think I need like five more until I'm able to unlock it. This shit was such a headache, man. There we go. So now we need four more. Fuck, dude. At what point will we um Rebellion. be able to enter here? What the fuck? <gasps> oh. Another one that I've been looking for. Yeah, let's go. Three more, I think. Hey, man. over here oh I don't think I've ever been here Rebellion. let's save it I think we got how many hours are we eight hours holy fuck Hopefully, okay, it looks better now. It's smoother now. I was about to say like, holy fuck, man. Oh my God, it's so much better now. Okay, so what, what, what is that? class oh shit is it time it's gonna save me so much time doing that come on now oh shit here we go i think i have like a motion controller motion for this one Attention, please. Sorry, Madam Kagawa. Everyone, please welcome a new student to our flying class. Hello. The goal Hello. Of today is to remind all of you how to maneuver on a broomstick safely, as broom flight is, first and foremost, a means of transportation. This, I fear, some of you have forgotten. Diving, rolling, and loop-the-loops will not be taught or in fact tolerated in this class. We'll leave that to professional Quidditch players, like the Toyohashi Tengu. Boo. Not a fan, I take it? Now, let's see how well everyone kept up with their practice over the summer holidays. For those who need a refresher, step up to your broom, say up firmly and clearly, then kick your leg over and rest your weight on the seat. Up! Now, your turn. Up, up, uh, up, you stupid ratty school broom. Oh, man. Chill. Up. Easy. One leg over, so there's a leg on each side. None of that side saddle nonsense. A gust of wind will throw you right off. Oh, 
Oh my god, I look so badass. And if you hear my whistle while you're in flight, ground yourself at once. Okay. Good. Now, for your first lesson, fly through each ring in the courtyard. Do take care. The brooms are school I think I'm property. The of this. I want them returned in one piece. This will take some getting used to. Excellent. Wait, what? Hold on. I thought motion control was on for this. Uh, collections. Motion on. What? Okay, I, whatever. Well done. Now that you're acclimatized to your broom, let's see how well you manage with a more advanced exercise, shall we? This next set of rings will take you around the grounds for more of a challenge. Wait, what was the controls? Oh my god, I didn't even see it. I see the rings around the grounds. What have you? Whoa. <laughs> that wasn't too bad. Oh, so click it once. Okay. Oh my god, that's so badass. Oh, the old boathouse. Wish you could have experienced crossing the lake as the first year. Ding, 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 ding. Oh my god, this is so cool. Whoa. Our aquatic resident <gasps> likes to make an what? appearance once in a while. <laughs> it grabs me. <laughs> oh my god, this make this makes traveling so much faster now. Oh, they did. Did anyone else see that? Oh man, there's no one around you. I watched you fly through those rings. You seem to handle yourself on that oh, dusty man, school riding, room dude. well enough. I'd imagine you're ready for something a bit more challenging. But I'm getting ahead of myself. We haven't properly met. I'm Everett Clopton. Am I right in suspecting that a Slytherin like you might be interested in making an escape from class? Let's go for it. No to that. What did you have in mind? A bit of a detour, so to speak. Follow me. Okay, say less. The tour is about to begin. Follow closely now. Whoa. Right now, we're flying over the Transfiguration Courtyard. Oh, what the as fuck? Lovely as ever. Let's hope the headmaster isn't having tea by the window today. Yo! What's up with the controls now? What the fuck? Gardens, the Hufflepuff common room windows just peek out. Bit claustrophobic for my taste. How is Everett flying so quickly? Here's something handy to know lean forward for a burst of speed. Helpful if you need to escape a tricky situation. L2 speed burst. <laughs> oh, now that's more like it. You sure you're not part hippogriff? There's the famous bridge. Oh, there's a speedometer. Magic holding it up. I mean, look at it. And the Owlery. That's a bit of solid architecture, isn't it? Flying tips and a jaunt around Hogwarts. This is quite the tour, Everett. That's Kagawa's whistle. This concludes our tour. Let's hurry back. I'll say less. Let me hit the nose real quick. Chaboing! Better hurry and hand in our brooms. 
Dismount here. <laughs> And where have ah, you great. been? Oh, hello, Professor. We were trying to get a bit of extra practice in. Hefty points will be taken from each of you for not following my instructions. Mr. Clopton, I'm disappointed in you. You're in this class because you're still because you're still not showing yourself, or frankly, your broom the proper respect. But Professor Enough. Class is finished for the day. Damn, dude, why you dis- Oh my god. As for you, you do well to use better judgment in the future. Chin up. That was some rather good fly. Hey, thanks, man. Hey, you now I feel like I was uh, <laughs> literally everywhere, but okay. Sorry about that business with Kagawa, but you have to admit those views were worth it. It was worth losing a few house points for that detour. You seem at home on a broom. Bet if you had a fancy model, you could fly laps around Imelda. She's Kagawa's favorite. I could show her a thing or two if I had my own broom. Hate having to return the school broom after class. Perhaps I'll have to purchase a broom then. If you can, you should. Wish I could. I recommend visiting Albie Weeks at Spintwitch's in Hogsmeade. He's always looking to test new models. I'll keep an eye out for you in the sky. Hey, finally. I've been waiting to do this. Okay. Um Okay, might as well go now then. Let's see. Uh, 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 right here? I think it was that one. Sometimes it seems all roads. How did you fare? If you're keen for some illicit spell practice, meet me outside the Defense Against the Dark Arts classroom. I know a discreet place near there. Good day to you. I require assistance with a delivery. I thought you might be interested. Please visit me at J. Pippin's Potions if you'd like to earn a few coins. Oh, perfect. Please meet me in the seventh floor corridor as soon as you can. I have an idea for somewhere you can focus on your studies, away from prying eyes and distractions. That's it? Okay. Holy shit, everyone oh, was hitting my line. Face. Wonderful. Um... Oh, hello. Hello, Mr. Weeks, is it? Albie Weeks at your service. Welcome to Spin Witches. Apologies if you came by before and weren't able to come in. Shop's been closed since trade routes were disrupted. Had to travel as far as London to meet with my supplier. And I've only just returned, thankfully with inventory. I presume you're in the market for a new broom? Got a few rare U weavers available. Ember dash, silver arrows, oh. wind wisps too. No matter what broom you choose, you'll be pleased. They're all exceptional, both in quality and performance. Uh, disrupted trays. What else? Let's, let's check it out. the array of brooms. I'll have a look around. Please don't Thank be expensive. You. Please don't be expensive. What are we looking for today? Okay, before we do that, let's um. You know, let's sell, let's sell the shit that I don't need. Doing business with you. Sell that, don't need that. Greens, yuck. Got on my face. Purple. Blue. Okay. I have 4,900, let's see. <gasps> oh, only 600? That item is of the highest quality. Oh. Oh, that is badass. Huh? All right. I mean, Slytherin, but I don't know. That one looks weird. That item is of the highest quality. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Uh, the perfect broom for those who uh 
for those with a fury temperament. Uh, a brilliant chance to celebrate your particular Hogwarts house prime. Finally crafted from ash, this broom is built for stability. That item is of the highest quality. Hmm, that could be cool. A stylish broom with a light touch, quite literally. A light touch? A light? Uh... I mean, I guess. A comfortable and speedy broom with a unique woven design. That item is of the highest quality. Nah. This is the one I want. Yeah. You'll be thrilled with that broom. I promise you. Now, we'll, this will be our, our main one. That item is of the highest quality. But this one will probably be the one that we travel with because it has a light and I need a light. You'll be thrilled with that broom. There we go. I promise you. Perfect. Thanks for stopping by. Whilst nearly any broom will certainly be a step up from the practice brooms in Kagawa's class, they all have their limitations. You seem to be a flyer who might be interested in, say, some enhancements? Go on. Ha! Knew I was right about you! I think you'll be quite happy with the performance of any broom at lower altitudes. But you may notice that speed consistency tends to falter as you rise. I believe I can remedy this issue. Okay. I have some ideas for enchantments, upgrades, if you will, that will improve the performance of any broom you fly. What I need is someone to conduct a broom flight and report back to me so I can perfect the upgrades. A broom As it flight? Happens, another Hogwarts student, Imelda Reyes, is using abandoned broom courses for time trials. Clever girl. An ideal situation for collecting flight statistics. If you were to compete for the best time and succeed, then report back to me with how your broom behaved, I could complete work on my first upgrade. What say? Holy shit, that sounds so complicated, but I'm still down. Sounds worth a try. That sounds intriguing. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. It'll be worth your while. If I'm right, the new upgrade ought to enhance brooms in every regard. Ooh. And I can give you a special prize. The time trial should be a bit of fun too. Go to the Quidditch pitch and Imelda Reyes will sort you out. Once you've beaten Imelda's time, be sure to let me know. Organizers and others prohibits flying. Look for no flying icons near Minimap to learn. Also, I can't even fly here. I help but admire Mr. Weeks' enthusiasm. Well, I think there's a side mission here, right? Rebellion. Let me see. What are we looking for today? Oh no. What? Thanks for stopping by. Hope to see you again. That's so weird how I can't um fly here. Kind of weird. 